Hi, this is Anil from Learning Lad and welcome to another tutorial on C programming language. In this video, we will see how we can learn C language. Uh, learning C language will be like learning any other language that you speak. For example, it is like learning English. If you have to learn English, then what you do is first you will learn the English alphabets and then you learn some words in the English language and then you will learn to create the sentences in English. But in order to create the sentences from words, you need to know the English grammar. This grammar is the set of rules that you have to follow in the language. And once you know how to create the sentences, you can create the stories or the poems or whatever you want to create, you can do that. Now here, just because you know how to create the sentences, it doesn't mean that you will be able to create the stories. That's because in order to create the stories or poems, you need to have some extra skill. And that skill is very important for you here. And similar to this one, if you want to learn C language, then first you need to learn about the C character set. And then you will learn about some concepts such as constants, variables, data types and then uh, you will learn about keywords etc and after that you will learn to create instructions or we call it as statements and here in order to create the instructions you have to follow the rules of the c language and after that you can create the programs by writing the instructions in the um, specific manner so here the important thing is if you know how to create the instructions it doesn't mean that you will be able to write the programs it is important to have a computational logic in order to write the programs for example you have to write a program to calculate the average of five numbers then you should have the logic for that problem and then you can implement that logic by writing the program by specifying the instructions or statements in a specific manner. So here the important thing is you need to have that ability to form the logic and also you need to learn how to create the instructions. Now one thing that you have to keep in mind is uh, you can develop your skill of uh, problem solving or creating logic. You know it will not come in just one day you have to practice and you have to work on different things and you can develop the skill of uh, solving the problems or uh, creating the logic. So here in this video, we will learn about the C character set. And in the upcoming videos, we will learn about constants, variables, data types and keywords. A character denotes any alphabet, digit or a special symbol used to represent information. In C programming language, we can use the English alphabets. We can use both uppercase and lowercase alphabets. We can have the characters from capital A to capital Z and also from lowercase a to lowercase Z. And also we can use the digits. So we can have the digits from zero to nine and we have some special symbols such as curly braces and then uh, parentheses, percentage symbol, plus, minus, multiplication, division, uh, semicolon, etc., etc. And we have some other special symbols are also available. So this is it guys for this video. If you like this video, then hit the like button. If you don't like it, then hit the dislike button. If you want to say something, then write that in the comment box. For more tutorials like this, do subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.